Masterpiece Arms, MPA 30T, coming up on Evo Heart Protection. Coming back at you with another one real quick. We got the Masterpiece Arms MPA 30T. A lot of you guys know it as like a little Mac, Mac replica, Mac knockoff, whatever you want to call it. But, hey, bump fire, whatever you want to do. If you actually had a license, you could make this thing full auto and this thing spit. This thing really do spit. Of course, if you know about these, you know it's 9 millimeter. I got a 9 and a 45 here side by side just so we can see the difference in size. The 9, of course, the one on the left for the people who don't know. The new ones are actually aluminum frames, so it's a lot lighter than the original. You know, those old school Macs, if you know anything about them. Them things are bricks, basically. Black Cerakote. See, blowback system, 5 and a half inch barrel. Threaded, half by 28. 5 and a half ounces all together coming in. Comes with a 30 round Tapco magazine. Uh, it's pretty, pretty much pr proprietary magazine. I don't think you have any options. I haven't seen any options myself as far as other magazines for it, but 30 rounds should be enough. I think you may have a lower round count magazine for like the California compliant 10, 10 round magazines or something like that. I'm pretty sure they do. For some, you know, some guys don't like the, the long sticks hanging out of them. It is a top cocking model, so you charge it on the top of it. Got the quick magazine release right at the bottom of the grip, and it's aluminum grip. Like I said, black shirt coat. Fox suppressor, so it's not a real suppressor, so you don't have to worry about that. It just it look cool. That thing will, I think, get a little hot, so be careful. You don't want to be squeezing it too long. I'm not really familiar with it. I don't really, no, actually, I don't think it get too hot, but I really don't know. Yeah, you got adjustable sights on this thing, so you can't play around with it. Took it out to the range, had a lot of fun shooting this thing. Uh, no problems, feed, no issues with that, and even uh, checked it out with the hollow points, and it fed those things pretty awesome. Like I said, five and a half ounces, pretty light. This To me, this is like a close range type. Uh, people say it's not accurate. I heard a lot of people talking about how it's not accurate. You're not trying to shoot 100 yards most of the time with a five-inch Burrow, even in competition shooting, no, they're not shooting out to 100 yards. So that hole is not accurate, blah, blah, blah. You know, y'all can chill out with all that. This is a close range style, close quarters, breaching the room type, full auto usually. Spray something within a couple feet of you so you can put the thread down. So the people that are in two max, pretty reasonably priced option right here. We have some footage coming soon shooting this thing. And... Showing you how, uh, how awesome this gun really is. Till next time, as always, be safe with firearms. Always, always practice safety. Always make sure everyone around you is safe. Never point a firearm at anything you're not willing to destroy. And till next time, take it easy.